good morning. It's about 6 a.m. here in Southern California. We got the VinFast VF8, and we're gonna cruise to the beach and see if we can get some waves. I got all three boards with me today, the skimboard, the surfboard, and the skateboard, because you never know what you're gonna get yourself into. The coolest thing about cruising in an all-electric car, you can just plug it in, charge it up, and go. Plus this one is big enough to fit all my gear. So let's load it in. The special compartment, the front trunk. I keep a change of clothes for any scenario that I get myself into. I have shorts if the sun comes out. I have a bikini if I'm in warmer water, towel, you know, warm jacket in case it does get cold. Really anything that I need in here to stay dry and separate from the back trunk. If my boards are wet or anything like that, the front trunk handles it all. We're ready. Kind of get moving it's gloomy right now so go for a little run the wildflowers are blooming it's springtime in california so that's the best time all down the coast leading into Laguna Beach. This is all part of it, just trying to find some spot that's gonna be good for waves. Also getting a little run in between. Going up and down the coast, you can't really beat it. You're gonna find something either way. So let's go see the next spot. Part of the reason I moved to California all the way from across the country in Florida was to be able to go to all these different spots. And this is the Stoke, this is the mission. We're always trying to find, you know, a good wave and something to film, something to have fun. So I have my internet, I can see Surfline and check the apps. I got all the boards in the back. So this car has all the features to be able to keep rolling. Hey, VinFast. Route me to Aliso Beach. Open the sunroof. So we're gonna try and find some surf and skim. This beach is pretty cool because at high tide or at low tide, you can usually find surf or skim. So we got both of the boards here. We're gonna take them out and see what we can get. Can't forget the towel. Let's do it. practice out here whenever I can. The water temp is definitely in the low 60s. I'll have those heated seats waiting for me in a little bit, so sick. Let's get some more. Fun session, but I'm ready for some heat. Got our heated seats. Oh, we got sandwiches? Sandwiches. Scrub time. Yes, it is. Best part of the day right here. We need to put the jams on. Let's turn it up. Turn up the volume. One of my favorite features about this car is that I always have the heads-up display telling me how fast I'm going, my lane control, and also the speed limit. 
We're gonna cruise up to this spot right here at the top of the hill. I love that this is also all wheel drive so I can take this up to the mountain. It's gonna handle properly. Woo, this road is so fun to drive on, especially in sport mode. Whole harbor right there. You can see all the way down the coast. Look at this view. I love how it knows exactly where you are, and even if you need it to make sure that it keeps you in the lane. This is crazy. The car can drive itself in the lane, but it's just an assistance, so it is cool to know that I'm always safe and the car is gonna keep its course. functional training area is my little avocado tree with one avocado. She serves a great purpose. Set these keys down. Got different things to work out your core using the balance board. Translating onto any sort of board sport that you work on. How I would be if I was on a board and I have to practice, you know, the unpredictable in the ocean, so. Everything. <laughs> I think it's time to work out hump up. Let's do it. cold tub it gets down to about 42 degrees and this is what I use for recovery and to make my body feel good and ready for the next session to get this ready the trick to this is it's all mentality commitment just knowing that you're gonna feel much better once you get out I try and do this every day for at least two minutes here we go it's the coldest water I'll get into so it makes the ocean that much easier to overcome, especially on those cold days like this. Just gotta breathe through it. Two, one. Never gets easier, but the feeling that you get afterwards and what it does for you, I think I'm ready to warm up, get into some warm seats, see what's next. A little snack for the road. Oakwats. <laughs> Easy to peel, good snacks. first loves I actually skated before a skimboard so I always try and still skate in between skimboarding sessions or whenever I can. One of the coolest things I've noticed about bringing the VinFast everywhere is that somebody usually always stops me and asks me about it and it's really cool to find that community of like-minded individuals that are all about sustainability, all electric cars and I'm ready for the skate session. shows me exactly where the car is so I can navigate. This is nuts. But look how well it tells me where to be so I don't hit anything. Just threading the needle. It showed me the whole car 360s. Found this park that we can charge at. Chill here for a little bit and then we can head back up the coast. Got a little something to pass the time. Let's see if this is even possible. This grass looks pretty thick. Hey, I'll take it. Let's see what kind of
the charge right now. Almost done. We did a quick charge, so it was free. I'm gonna go ahead and stop it and take it out. Ready to get back on the road. One of the best things about living in Southern California is having a bonfire right on the beach. You can park your car right up on the sand and then we got a fire and sunset. This is her favorite, hanging out at the beach. She's got all this space back here. Hey, VinFest, turn on Miley's playlist. Let's head home and uh, charge up for the next day. All right, catch you next time. Bye.